Hey guys, welcome to fourth grade chapter four, lesson six. We're gonna go ahead and get started with number two. So it wants us to break up the numbers into compatible numbers, okay? So 81, okay? Thinking of numbers that three goes into, well, three goes into 60 and three goes into 21. So that's how I broke it up, okay? So three goes into 60, three goes into six twice, then I have that zero, plus three goes into 21, seven times, it's 27, okay? That's what they want you to do, okay? Don't worry, we're gonna do numbers three and four too, okay? So, number three, it says 232, divided by four. Well, I know that four goes into 200 and I know it goes into 32. So that's how I broke it up, okay? So four goes into 20 five times, then add that zero on, and four goes into 32 eight times. So 58, okay? I know it's a little bit confusing when you first start, you will get better at it, I promise, okay? So, 305 divided by five. Well, there's 300 and then there's five, okay? So five goes into 30 six times, add that zero one, and five goes into five once, 61. Okay, I want you guys to do through 10. You totally can, I believe in you, okay? We are gonna go down and do number 11 and it says Cecily picked 219 apples. She divided the apples equally into 20, oh, sorry, into three baskets. How many apples are in each basket? So we have 219 divided by three, okay? So it wants us to use kind of compatible numbers, okay? Hold on one second, sorry about that. Um, Okay, and I know that three goes into 210 or 21. So 210 divided by three. And I know that it has nine divided by three. I know that both of those would work. Okay, so three goes into 21, seven times, tack that zero on. And then three goes into nine, three times. 73 apples. Okay, this is how many apples. Make sure that you're using your labels, okay? All right, number 12 says, Jordan has 260 basketball cards. Okay, he divides them into four groups. How many cards are in each group being labeled in cards? Whatever our answer is, it's gonna be in cards, okay? So, I know that four will go into 200, and I know it'll go into 60. Okay, so four goes into 20, five times, tack that zero one, and four goes into 60, 15 times, okay? So now 50 plus 15 is 65. So 65 cards. Write down your work, guys, okay? All right, you guys are going to do 13 and 14. You guys are also going to do the lesson check on the back, okay? And we're going to go down and do the spiral review, okay? All right, so number three says, Last Saturday, there were 1,486 people at the Cineplex. There were about the same number of people in each of the six theaters. Between which two numbers does the number of people in each theater fall? Well, I could send that to 1,400 or I could send it to 1,500, right? Okay. So... Zero, zero, six times four is 24, carry. Six times one is six, plus two is eight. So, 8,400. And 
6 times 0, 0, and then 6 times 5 is 30, carry that 3, 6 times 1 is 6, plus 3 is 9. There we go, okay? Oh, yikes, guys, I did that totally backwards. I'm so sorry. So scratch that. Don't write what Miss Leah just wrote. Okay. So into six. Sorry about that, guys. They split that up into six theaters. See, we're problems, there are problems for grown ups too. Okay. So six isn't going to go into one. Six will go into 14 twice for 12. Get two left over. Two is smaller than six, so I can bring down my eight. Six will go into 28 four times. Four times six is 24. Subtract, get four. Okay. Four is smaller than six, so I'm going to bring down my other six. Okay. Six will go into 46. Let's see. Six times eight is 48. Six times seven is 42. Okay, with four left over. So, between 200 and 300 people. 247 is between 200 and 300. Between 200 and 300 people. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Okay, Nancy walks 50 minutes each day for 40 plus weeks. Jillian walks. 35 minutes each day for six days. How does the total number of minutes that Jillian walked compare to the total number of minutes Nancy walked? Well, first, we need to find out how many it is, okay? So, four times five is 20, and then I'm gonna add that zero one, okay? So, that one's Nancy, okay? Jillian, I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that in my head. So I'm going to go 35, and I'm going to multiply that by 6, okay? So 6 times 5 is 30, carry the 3. 6 times 3 is 18, plus 3 more is 21. So, so Jillian walked 10 more minutes than... Nancy. Okay. All right. So, three boys share 28 toys, toy cards equally. How many cards did each boy get and how many were left over? Well, three. So, if I did 28 divided by three, the closest I can get, sorry, you guys can't see that is three times nine is 27. So nine cars each and 28 minus that 27 would be one left over. Make that a one instead of another L, okay? All right, an airplane flies at a speed of 474 miles per hour. How many miles does a plane fly in five hours? So four, seven, four times five. And whatever it is, it's gonna be in miles, okay? Five times four, 20, carry that two. Five times seven, 35, plus two more is 37, carry the three. Five times four again is 20, plus three, 23. 2,370 miles. All right, guys, thanks for hanging out for 4.6. Come on back for 4.7. See you soon.